Hi everyone, welcome back to the my channel. My name is Anil and in this Angular video tutorial we will see that how we can get the value of a text box. So these are the two way which in which we are just going to fetch the value of a text box. One is we are uh, get the value on, uh, just entering on the text and second one we will fetch the value on a button click also. Alright and for these two things we just need to define the uh, a button and text box in the HTML file then we can just make a function inside the TS file and we will just write a little bit code to fetch value alright so let's go inside the HTML file first of all and uh, keep in mind that the HTML file and TS file should be in the same component alright so I am working in a app component right for now so in the app dot component HTML file just define a input and here let's uh, define an event also uh, like key up right and here we let's just use a function with the name of let's say get well and here in we can just pass dollar event in this function uh, perfect so now let's come on the app.component.ts file and let's define here function which is the get well and let's take a parameter like uh, 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 item and in this function uh, let's just console dot log these values like item dot target dot value all right so now you can see that whenever i'm just going to enter uh, in this text box then you will just get the output in the console right so let's say i'm just going to put here hi then you can see that we got this value all right so even you can also use here alert like this just say put hi like this all right so now actually you just let's say you just want that uh, i want to just get this text box value on a button click all right so for that let's define uh input uh, okay uh, we already have an input so we don't need to define it so just define here a button and just put some text like get value and on just define a click function also here on the click function let's call a function like get text box value text box well all right you can make any name whatever you want of this function so i'm just going to remove this for now and let's put an id here for putting the id in the angle just use the hash and some ids like text all right and just pass this text here simply perfect now let's come back to the ts file and just change this uh, function name and just put here item dot value all right and now let's see what we are actually getting here so let's put here anil and let's try to hit this get value and now you can see that the text box value is alerted here all right so this is a simple way if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel channel and like this video bye bye take care